Hello everyone. So in today's tutorial, I will be showing with you how to make neon glow element effect in Canva. So let's start with it. So I will choosing Instagram post as our canvas. Okay. So let's zoom it for you so that you can understand in a better way. Okay. So all the things which I will use are all available in Canva. So you have not to worry about any type of uh, outside features or from any other third party website. You don't have to take any type of pictures or elements from elsewhere. You can all find it in the Canva app. Okay. Canva app or Canva website, wherever you use is upon you and you can design the whole thing in app and in website in both the segment it is possible so i am showing you in the website version you can try it in the app and you can share with me if the effect is same or not in the comments and before starting i am requesting all of you to please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any notification of video which are uploaded in our channel so let's start so first i will go to elements and choose radiant you can type or uh, as i have already typed it before so i am just choosing it so i will go to graphics and i will select this one and click it make it bigger okay so it's covering the whole background so now i will do the next thing which i will go to photos and type in Asian Omen Singer. Okay, so I will choose a image where the full body is covered. Okay, so let's search for it and I will use this image ok so I will go to edit image and use background removal and it did the work beautifully and i will just zoom it make it bigger so that i can use in a better way okay so the next work which i will do is duplicate this and i will just cut it from here and paste it right here okay you will understand why i am doing this in the next step okay so for the next element i will use this keyword which is neon gradient mean purple star frame okay you can copy it directly from here and you will paste it here okay the first star which is coming here you will use this make it slightly bigger ok and keep it right here ok now it's time to duplicate it and we will rotate it ok like this again rotate it again duplicate paste it here rotate it make sure they are coming in adjacent positions so that no one looks like they are different from the other okay duplicate it 
and rotate it. and this is the done here yeah, and now we will use this image i will copy and paste it here okay let's bring it in the same position and now i will just crop it okay so it looks like it is coming out of the frame so it's also a 3D effect, it gives a 3D effect to the image and as you can see it looks good. You can just click Ctrl A to increase the size. Okay, so as you can see our work is done and it is looking great and you can use it for the your designs and your own purposes i hope you like the tutorial stay tuned to our channel and don't forget to subscribe until then check out our previous videos right here thank you